Hey, this is Chase. Just going to give you a little bit of a heavy metal workout today. Just give you some endurance in this wrist of yours. So what you're going to do is we're going to count one and two and three and four in. Or for some of you, you can just count to eight. We're going to do one and two and three and four and all in down pick on each note that I tell you. So it's going to sound like this. One and two and three and four and. All right. So we're going to do it on an open E power chord. So open E. And then your second finger is going to be on the second fret, fifth string. I use my first finger, you can do it either way. We're going to count to one and two and three and four. Then we're going to jump up to the G power chord here, or G5 on the third fret. Then on the fifth fret of the sixth string. Then we're going to go up to eight. And we're only going to go one and two and. We're going to drop back to seven, three, and four, and so, one, two, third fret, one, two, and three, and four, fifth fret, one, two, and three, and four, and eighth fret, one, two, and seventh fret, three, and four, and so all together. All right, so you want to be able to speed that up, like. All right, and I'm kind of palm muting it. My hand across the strings here. So what that's going to do is we're going to give it an accent on one. So we're going to be one and three and four. And keep it quiet, all except for the first note, so it'll ring out as an accent. Fig. I kind of let the last note be an accent too, I guess. It's up to you. Personal preference. Then after you do all that. I want you to do that four times, and then I want you to go into the octaves. So what I want you to do is you're going to play octaves on the seventh fret of the A string, or the fifth string, and you're going to skip a string and do like your power chord, but this is your octave. So you're going to have your first finger on seven on the fifth string, and then your third finger is going to be on the ninth fret of the third string. So that's your octaves. So we're going to do the same thing. One and two and three and four and. You're going to slide up to ten and do it four times. You don't have to palm mute any of these. Slide back to three. One and two and three and four and. And then do three for again. One and two and three and four and. Slide back to the second fret and do three and four and. So seventh fret. 10th fret, 3rd fret, 3rd fret, 2nd fret, so all together we go. Thank you. 
So if you can last that long, you're going to have some pretty pumped up forearms. So just practice it slowly at first, you know. Yeah. And when you get up to speed, keep trying, get faster, get stronger, playing it for longer times. If you can do that like five times, you'd be pretty tough. So keep it up, keep trying, all right?